Apex is a new easy to use 3D printing software developed by Airwolf 3D to make slicing easier and pain free. To download Apex, click the link in the description. Download Apex and open the exe file. Agree to the licensing agreement. Here you can choose to keep the default settings or choose custom options. I suggest keeping the default options. Click install. Once installed, it will then ask you to install the device drivers. Hit Next, then Install. These drivers are necessary to run your printer through USB as well as install custom firmware. Once complete, hit Finish. Now in the Apex Setup, hit Next. Select Start Apex, then select Finish. You will now select your printer model, then hit Finish. Apex will now open. When the welcome screen appears, hit OK. Apex is now ready to use. Apex comes preloaded with a sample STL file. To load a different STL file, go to File, Load Model. In the Quick Print menu in the left column, you can select your print material, print quality, nozzle being used, and support options. Click on the model to access the transform menu. A menu will now appear on the bottom left corner of the platform window. There you will find Rotate, Scale, and Mirror. First click the Rotate icon. You can now rotate your model by 15 degree increments by clicking and dragging the colored circles surrounding the model. Now click the Scale icon. Here you can scale your model by a percentage or by actual dimensions. You can scale uniform to keep things in proportion, or if you click the lock icon, you can scale using each axis independently. In the mirror menu, you can mirror your model in the X, Y, or Z axis. We now want to preview the layers before printing. Click on your model, then click the view mode icon on the top right of the platform window. Click on the layers icon on the bottom of the menu and use the scroll bar to view the layers. This will show the print with the settings applied. Once you are happy with your model, you are ready to print. We will be printing using the micro SD card. Go to file, save G code. Choose the micro SD card from the file browser window and save the G code file. You are now ready to install the SD card into the printer and hit print.